the Weatherman here with Thomas Walrus. Thomas, so first of all, you thought it would be bad luck earlier to interview with me. Yeah, How are you definitely. feeling now? Uh, well, I mean, since you asked me to interview me, I had like uh, 160k in chips and was very uh, sort of superstitious. And now, since I declined, I've gone down to like 45,000. So I'm feeling kind of bad that I didn't do it earlier. I think it was bad luck actually not doing it. Oh, well, that's okay. Anyway, so how's your day been going? Tell me about it. Uh, I started off with like 77,000 in chips, uh, built that to about 110 with a, with a single showdown, just basically firing on the river and they folded. Everything went nice. Uh, um, raced early position 4-7, got re-raced by Queens. I got the odds to call, so I called, flopped to a pair, knocked the Queens out. I was up to 160, everything was going fine. Um, after that, I've lost every single hand I played. You said you've been pretty card dead today, is that right? Yeah, I have uh, I've had eight times pocket nines, uh, missed every flop, and uh, apart from that, only one big pair. No ace-kings, nothing, so pretty bad. Do you think there's any truth to it when they say that European players play a little bit more crazy? I don't think I'm crazy. I mean, like, I, I choose my spots and up until, like, the past two hours spots have been right. Like, I lost 20,000 just before the break when uh, our table chip leader opened for a raise. David Oppenheim called, and then I have deuce eight off in the small blind, and I figure it's a good steal opportunity, so I make it 20,000. And then the first, the chip leader calls, and then David Oppenheim moves all in, so, uh, so yikes. Well, I mean, I think David had ace king. Actually, actually, for a second there, you know, I thought about calling with deuce eight because of the odds, but uh, I'm not that crazy anyway. Sometimes you are, I've seen you. Anyway, um, the, you always make time to do other things other than poker, I've noticed. Skydiving, snowboarding. How do you make time for all of that? It's your everywhere. I think the key is to getting knocked out early from tournaments. <laughs> <laughs> Probably, yeah. Well, anyway, good luck the rest of the tournament. Talk to you later. Thanks, Amanda. Right. I'm Amanda Leatherman with PokerWire.com.